this tip, tip. Step so light, I barely touch the ground. Now everybody wants to know how. Brick by brick, I put them in the ground. Walk, walk like I built, walk, walk, walk like I built this. I do it for my people, family business. Yeah. Good morning, family, and man, is it a busy day today. I've got my to-do list of everything I need to get done today. What you saw this morning was my breakfast. It's a high-carb day. I'm just getting some work done, emails, comments, and also getting my absentee ballot done. So if you guys have never done that, make sure you do. I will still be at school when that happens in Maryland. Getting that taken care of. It's nice that you can do it through the mail. But another thing I need to take care of is my April rent. So doing that right now. One more rent to pay, and then I am totally done with all that, which will be very, very nice. Now I'm trying to cross the street without getting hit. A good day to get things done. I'm walking to Seton Hall right now, because I gotta get my fourth session of cardio in and my third session of abs today. And I also have to take some other Take care of some other things on campus. I'm trying to get that done early on a Friday. It's 10:30, so before all the offices close. So I'll take you guys along with me. To start wearing sunglasses when I'm walking around campus. I'm always squinting, so apologize for that. And I also need to stop saying so. It's tough when I'm editing. I try to edit that out, but I say it so much. Anyway, what you just saw me doing was filling out a form to get my diploma mailed to me rather than having to pick it up because we don't actually get it until July. And obviously, I will not be here in July, so getting that mailed to me. Also, I'm going to go over my schedule for the next two weeks. At the end of the video, I mentioned in that that in the last episode but I'll be going over that at the end because it's a lot going on I just want to let you guys know what to expect and just kind of how crazy it's gonna be but it's all a good crazy because like I said graduating very very soon but I'm now walking to the rack so that I can get my cardio and abs done for the day and then on to more things so I will see you then <music> Let's talk about that moment when Ever Ford, aka Max Tuning, uses the picture you posted for their page. Right there. My picture. Not that big of a deal, but it's kind of cool. Since, you know, I take photography very seriously and to see that happen, kind of a big milestone kind of for me, but pretty cool. So if you saw this picture, this was in fact mine, so shout out to Everford and Max Tuning for doing that. Really do appreciate that and love, love the story behind Everford and I think the company and Max does a great job. So pretty cool, pretty cool, or as he would say, pretty cool. <sighs> but finally got the shades on because it's hot, even though I'm wearing long sleeves. Still in the same clothes that I got my cardio and abs done in which was really, really good, got a good sweat. But now it is 1.45, accomplishing everything on my list. In fact, everything is just about crossed off on here. Got one thing to do, but that's for you guys and it won't be until the end of the video. Also, when I was doing my cardio, I watched Kristen Guzman's Summer Shredding episode, the one that came out on today, Friday. And he was talking about his you know, physique update and how he just finally hit a new low weigh-in after like seven or eight days and even though the scale isn't moving as much his physique has changed dramatically and obviously if you guys watch him then you know what i'm talking about you know he's definitely leaning down even though the scale doesn't change as much and that's how i personally feel so i'm headed to the gym right now and i think i'm gonna play well just show some pictures on the screen from like week one to right now currently hopefully i can get that if not all this is a waste but like you said although my weight hasn't changed dramatically and even right now, sitting at 154.8 this morning for the second day in a row. Um, my goal is 150 by next Friday, so I have a week. You know, I don't, 
Do I push to try to get down to 150 or do I just let it do its process? Because obviously I feel a lot, a lot leaner than when I started, you know, bloating has gone down. It just, these pants that I have on right now, when I put my phone in them, I kind of have to hold them up or like tie the string tighter. So like little things like that and just things you notice in pictures and hopefully the pictures will be up. So like what he said, although the scale isn't changing a lot for him, his appearance and physique has changed a lot so this is really like a mental check and i think that video is very good for me it came in good timing because i can't go by the scale all the time and i know that and i used to be oh scale 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 all the time but if i feel good and i look good that's really all that matters so kind of a mental check hopefully the picture's up but i'm gonna head to the gym it's legs and shoulders not gonna show that i'm gonna turn on some good music i'm in a great mood because i'm accomplishing everything on my list and it's only 145 i'm gonna stop talking hopefully you guys are enjoying the video and i'll see you later was that a workout or what? Also just chilling out in the back of my car, I thought I'd change up the scenery. And there's a nice breeze, hopefully it's not messing up with the mic, but did legs and shoulders and I'm dead tired. I just walk in between all like the sets and different exercises, just. It's a lot when you're doing cardio in the morning with abs and then gonna come back and get a full workout in. But I mean, I like it, it's just I definitely felt tired today, so I might do a rest day tomorrow, which will be Saturday for me, uh, rather than do one on Monday, which is gonna get into my schedule. So this will be the end of the video. Can I go over my schedule for the next few days? It is my birthday week. So I only have classes on Mondays, as you guys know. So Monday I will probably not take a rest day. I'll still do all my cardio, that'll be the same, but I'm gonna try to catch, uh, get ahead of my workouts because this weekend, my mom is coming up to visit on Thursday. We're gonna spend the day in the city. So if any of you guys are there in the city on Thursday, that's where I will be. Not sure exactly what we're doing, but that will be the plan. So that is Thursday the 21st then. We're going to the city and then driving home that night. So I will be in Maryland on my birthday, which will be the last video for the daily uploads. So Friday the 22nd will be the last video of daily uploads. But you can expect videos every other day after that. So I already have a video planned because obviously on Thursday I'm not gonna be able to edit anything. So I'll have a video planned for Friday for you guys. It's an important, important one, I've already got it planned out. But then after that you can expect every other day. So the next video after that will probably be, you know, my birthday weekend, kind of traveling, vlogging, foods that I eat. And I won't be tracking Thursday when I'm in the city or my birthday because honestly, who wants to do that? So a little bit of a diet break, but I'm still going to continue with the beach prep. You know, it doesn't just stop on my birthday. I want to continue this probably four weeks after my birthday. I say that now, but things can change. And just while I'm home, the Wi-Fi is just so bad that if I wanted to do daily uploads, I'd have to cut the video short and only record like half of my day just to have enough time for it to load and get up on YouTube for the next day. And it's just not worth it. I want to put 100% into all my videos and I can only do that if I do every other day. Hopefully you guys understand that. So I'll be home for that weekend, the 22nd, the 23rd, 24th. I come back April 25th for classes. I'll be at school for a week, then I go home. Do you know where Comcast moved to? I have no idea. Okay. Trying to get my video in here and people everywhere. Wanted to change scenery. Anyway, back to me. So. May 2nd is my last day of classes. And for me, being a senior, I have no exams whatsoever. Lucky me. On May 2nd, that Monday, will be my last day of classes. I will come home for good May 3rd, that Tuesday. I only have to come back for May 16th, that Monday for graduation. So I'm looking at my phone to get my dates right for you guys. So I'll be home for two weeks straight. And like I said, you know, videos will be every other day while I'm at home just because the Wi-Fi is so bad. I want to get out good content for you guys. So I will only come be coming back up to school May 16th for graduation. I'll have a special, special video for you guys on May 16th. I'm very excited for that. I'm working on it right now. And it's going to be a good one, I promise. But that's in about four weeks or so. So that's kind of the rough schedule for the next few days or few few weeks. Hopefully that all made sense. I kind of just want to give you guys a heads up of what to expect and kind of why I've been so busy lately. But that's what's going on with me. That's what you can expect. If you have any comments or questions, please leave that down below. I really do appreciate that. I'm excited for the next month. There's a lot going on, but it's all great stuff that's planned. You guys will see everything, take you guys along, which is awesome. I love that. So hopefully you enjoyed this video. I'm starving right now, so I'm going to go back, get a post-workout meal. It's going to be 
Amy's Pizza that I had my refeed day, so I'm really looking forward to that. I'll probably get a few clips of that for you guys, but thank you so much for all the support. Thank you for watching this video. If you did make it this far, please hit that thumbs up. That really does help me. Again, if all those dates and everything was confusing, don't worry. Obviously, I'll get a video up every day, and I'll take you guys along, so you'll see. Just stay up to date with that, 9 a.m. every single morning, Easter time. So thank you once again. Like, comment, share, subscribe if you have not already, and as always, have a great day.